There are a number of medications that fertility specialists use to help patients who have PCOS who do not ovulate to ovulate regularly so that they can conceive. One of the more common medications is a medication called clomiphene citrate or clomid. We've used clomid for over 40 years to help patients who have irregular ovulation ovulate. It's a medication that is started during the early part of your menstrual cycle, usually right after you've started having menstrual bleeding, and taken for five days at a dose between one and three pills. And that medication then will help your brain produce more hormones to stimulate the ovaries so that you can produce a mature follicle. We to tell if you're producing a follicle by commonly doing procedures like ultrasound to measure the follicles to see if those follicles are developing into a mature follicle which will then ovulate. Fomar is a medication that will also help you develop a mature follicle. The way it works is like Clomid, you take it during the early part of your menstrual cycle between one and four pills for five days and then we monitor with ultrasound to see if you're developing a mature follicle. There have been recent studies done by the National Institutes of Health that suggest Fomara is more effective than Clomid for patients with polycystic ovarian syndrome. So more and more I'm using this as my first line drug. For those patients who don't respond to those medications, there is another class of medications called gonadotropins, which are injectable medications. Gonadotropins work directly on the ovary to stimulate the growth of the follicles. And most patients with PCOS will develop a follicle with gonadotropins. Some patients with polycystic ovarian syndrome, when they are started on metformin, will start to have regular cycles and ovulate on their own uh, without the help of additional medications. Other patients that may have taken Clomid or Fomara that fail to ovulate, when you add metformin to their uh, regimen of medications, will now ovulate regularly with a combination of metformin and uh, Clomid. So metformin is a great tool for us to help for patients who are what we call Clomid resistant, who aren't ready to go to the expense or the risks of injectable medications such as gonadotropins.